beautiful day. We're gonna go for the travel. Such a nice sunny day. And this rainy season you need to catch the days like this <laughs> and use them in the best of your ability. That's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna go for the waterfall. Meantime I explore the local neighborhood. Here we have here. That's my way to the waterfall. Fifteen minutes south of Cagayan. Beautiful views. Quiet place. What a beautiful view. Uh, someone's built a small kubu. It's such a beautiful place. And beautiful views. Such a beautiful view, check this one, gorgeous valley, beautiful sunny day, green lash, landscape, blue sky, yeah, just positive emotions. So if you're tired and being in a city and you feel like you're, you're running this rat race, come over, pick up your bikey, 20 minutes and you're gonna be in places like this, waterfalls, beautiful viewpoints from the hillsides so there is a such huge variety where you can choose from and if you're a little bit adventurous so you can climb up on the hill and enjoy the magical view and a fresh breeze
here we have a beautiful place for every country. Rich in iron and other minerals. We have another beautiful day in beautiful nature. Spend a few hours. Go for the swim. Get the mud bath. Very well spend the time. Feel energized, recharged. Beautiful place. And the water is just uh, very rich in uh, minerals and iron. That's not uh, not an issue. Very rich in iron. Nothing in the world is better than clean, beautiful nature. I always feel like the best kind of time for me is when I'm immersing myself in the wild nature. Half day, day, if you are able to stay a few days. Beautiful, perfect. Nothing comes close to the mud bath and wild waterfall deep in jungles. Such a beautiful scenery. Rainy season, you see, afternoon, it gets cloudy. And the road here is kind of very difficult, so I need to go before rain comes over. Well, this is a beautiful place. I hope to see you soon. It's a organic one, high in the mountains, rich soil, clean water. It couldn't be cleaner than here because it's just the top of the mountain. Everything that comes here is just from the rain. Rain water. Yeah. Beautiful healthy corn. Top of the hill. Rain water, minerals, sun, clean air. If there is no chemicals, then that's the best. Beautiful views. And quietness of such a value. Quiet environment. I'll be going back to my daily chores in the city. The dogs, roosters. When you are able to see the difference, you can compare the side by side so you understand the value. People who live in the city, they don't understand what they miss.
you need to experience to understand. As always, as I say, you don't know what you don't know. Spend the day a week and it's going to be very hard for you to go back to the noisy part of the city. Well, welcome back. <laughs> welcome back to civilization. Hello, good evening. Beautiful stuff, yeah. When you cook uh, your lanka? This afternoon. Today, yeah. It's very hot. Ah, okay. Lanka is always, that's my favorite one. You see, you have okra. Yeah, yeah, it's okra. Where's my okra? There, you can use the lupin along for your hands. Oh, I have a spoon, it's okay. The plate. Yeah. With rice, no rice. No rice. <laughs> no rice, yeah. Only lanka. Well, I'm gonna take Lanka, I'm gonna think a little bit more. This it if you like it, huh? This is our Lanka. Lanka. I like Lanka. Very good. Yeah. I like Lanka. Lanka is my favorite stuff. Uh, you try if you like steaks. Yeah. <laughs> With the coconut milk. Yeah, very good. Okay. <laughs> well, I'll take a little bit of chicken, chicken liver, yeah. No, just the, here, yeah, yeah. a separate plate. Right, so it's here. Yeah, yeah, we do in Europe always like yeah, this. Okay. We put on it one plate everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like this. Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful. Stop studying money. Well, no, no. It's gonna go away. It's no, it's not possible to continue like this. Europe is open, so you will be open after one, two months or so. My favorite lanka and will be chicken liver. But that's well, the right. Well, that's we the right. Are, yeah. And we have unlimited rice. So yeah, we have well, that goes. The rice always goes to the, the to the places which you don't want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be going here a little bit or there. Now it goes. Yeah. I know you you used to that I know yeah. it's difficult but it's so addictive yeah, because I don't eat rice I don't eat uh, uh, junk food as we call I know uh, it's difficult but you try try a little bit you have a beautiful lanka beautiful pumpkin less fat um. <laughs> maybe <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Falls. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, beautiful one. Yeah. Yeah. Like brown water and Dynamo. stones and everything. Yeah, it's brown because it's raining. The rainy in the season, yeah. Yeah, raining in the bucket, so the the, From the mountains, so the, the Utah will go into the hill in the water. So. But when it's not rainy, the water is clear. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, okay. But it is raining. But I was enjoying anyway. Muddy, full of the minerals. There's no like that in your place, no brown water. No, we have sometimes. No, we have also, yeah, because we have also rivers, so it's cleaner. There's no no pollution, like you know, the washing powder or uh, herbicides or pesticides. That's that's the thing. Hi, Kobu and Sinkamas. Sinkamas, Atalong, Sibarilia, Agmane, Tita. Okra. Okra is very yummy to eat when it's about. Okay. Not like the salad. You can you can bring me also the pumpkin over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The binataang gulay in. Beautiful veggies. Well, indeed, you will be always able to find them. Small dishes. So many local dishes, which is uh, nutritious uh, veggies. So why should you go for the rice? People are used to eat rice, but in general, there's no need here. Nice meat, nice veggies, and you're done. Something. A little bit of okra. Well, I know the lumpia. Yeah, it's plainly blue, like no meat. But the difference. My understanding, is, this is a very good one. Beautiful. Yeah, that's it. That is, huh? What Bisayang is? gulai. Yeah, yeah. Bisayang gulai. Baskoy in Bisayang. Okra, you have a moringa. Pumpkin. You have a pumpkin. Sitao. Yeah. Beans, string beans. Beans. Well, very beautiful. The only one worry for me, what kind of water you use? It's mineral water. From the tap water? Ah, uh, no, it's tap water because, you know, it's boiled. Before putting all the 
like we'll understand but that's a problem because the water here from the tap is very heavily processed water so the only problem is the water if you have a clean water and you can boil all those ingredients in clean water then it's like how much rice the rice in a day three times a day three times in a day one yeah. bowl of the rice yeah one cup like this one cup i know i know yeah, yeah. like this so three cups in a day yeah and is the weight maybe 200 grams? Yeah, maybe more than or more. 1000 kilocalories in a day. A day, yeah. Cook in the morning, something around 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock in the morning. It's uh, around 4 o'clock in the morning, and then we have our display until 12 until, until lunch. And then we have we close. Yeah. We have our break, our body break, bro broken time. We have our broken time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then open and at 4 o'clock. We cook at 3 p.m. this afternoon. So that's why it's food, still yeah. warm, yeah. Yeah. We cannot, we cannot display the food from morning, morning till morning, now. Yeah. yeah, that's very good, yeah. yeah. It should be like this. We because eat only warm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we have a rules like four hours after the cooking, yeah, you can yes. consume food. That's why we cook at around four, four o'clock in the morning, and then four, five, six, seven, eight until twelve. Lunch lam talaga. The food will be until only until lunch time. After that time, one one p.m. we will dispose the food. Like there in the bahu, okay. baboi, we, we we let the baboi, yeah, 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 the, yeah, 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 the, yeah, yeah, the, the tira tira, the remaining food, yes, 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 yeah, yes, yes. Then, and then we cook again three o'clock this afternoon for dinner. Some people are working night shifts, so we buy na lang for their dinner yeah. here, our regular customer, beautiful, yeah, should be like this, yeah, yeah. But do you have access to the organic like tomatoes, pepino? No. We cannot buy that for for our business. Well, I understand it's too expensive. Yeah. But do you have uh, some farms which is uh, around here who, who produce the organic foods? Do you know some? Lion. Hill lion. Yeah. Uh, hi. Organic. Organic cabbage. Organic cabbage. That's beautiful. But we cannot afford to buy it's too expensive. And maybe you know the name name of the farm or uh, name of the place, Barangay. You can search it on internet. I'm, I searched, there is no, no good information. It's very difficult to find organic farms. It's not a farm in the region because the source of meat here is farming. Farming, yeah. So there's a lot of garden there that uh, using organic fertilizer. Exclusive for the we'll understand, yeah. yeah. It is. In Europe is also everything which is organic, like is three times more expensive, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I guess it's worth that. You don't eat so much in a day, you know. You don't need much, like two tomatoes, one pepino, one sinkamas, and you're good. Yeah, only if it's organic. It's lumi. Ah, lumi, yeah. like a mommy. Yeah, it's mommy. It's mommy. Not daddy. It's mommy. I see. It's egg and uh... pancet. Yeah. Yeah. Come over here and enjoy the local treats. Tastes amazing. This local gulai. It's very interesting. Yeah. And you see, you have a beautiful lanka also. Mm. Yeah, I like it. This Janet, very good. Girls, what about you? What's your favorite dish? Something special that you like most? The bong. See the bong. Me? Yeah. This pork chop. Pork chops, yeah. Yes. Very good, yeah. This. If you're gonna go out, Jollibee, McDonald's. What's your favorite? Chicken. Chicken? Yeah. Wow. Oh. Any kind of chicken. Chicken and You want to test? I'm gonna take it. Okay. You're gonna try La Bong. Wow. La Bong. I see you have a fish a little bit. What kind of fish is this one? Hawaiian. Yeah, truly interesting. 
That's more intensive taste. <laughs> That's gonna be dish number six, I guess. Ooh. Thank you ladies, thank you. See you, see you later, thank you. The fish, hello, hello, hello. Hello, what's up? Hello. We have marang. Marang. How much is your marang? 20. 20, yeah. I see the marang is in the season. Matamis. It's in each corner, everybody sells the marang. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you for today. Rice, 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 as always. Hello. Hey, my friend. Hello. How are you? Thank you. Now I feel happy. We have beautiful meals. Hello, hello. What is that? That's the heavy bamboo. Bamboo strips. Bamboo strips, yeah. I was thinking it's bamboo. Yeah. Can I check a little bit? Check this one. Yeah. Really good, yeah. You see, beautiful Hello, hello. Thank you, thank you guys. Thank you. Have a good business day today. Good customers, rich one. The fruits. Yeah, thank you. Meat. That's a major spot, you see the transportation stops over here and people passing through the street, getting the, the food for the evening, having the meals. For me as always, I love the local stuff, local produce. The only worry for me is uh, how clean is this. I want to see more uh, organic food, more organic production. And of course, if you have organic production, it should be... It should be understandable how this organic production is uh, controlled. If you have a label that that's organic, what kind of organization have, a, have checked that?